certificates. It's just the keeping things accountable and it is just being able to give a voice to to people, to the everyday person, to voices that might go unheard, otherwise minorities, um, and just making sure that everyone gets the chance or everyone has the opportunity to be informed. Legal journalism is all about people too. And for me, it also shines a very bright light on the darkest corners of our society. And without it, the John McLeans of this world remain faceless and the Damien Hetheringtons of this world are left voiceless. It's a tough area of journalism though, and picking up the microphone outside court some days can feel like holding a live grenade, but it is a very important one. And the fact that the Law Society of Ireland recognizes it every year through the Justice Media Awards is testament to that. My aim was to present key legal issues that are relevant to third level students and in such a way that they can engage, that they can understand and that they can benefit from it. I think legal journalism matters because we in the media are the voice of the voices and the underprivileged and the marginalised. I know it's a cliche, uh, but it is true and it continues to be true, uh, more so perhaps now than ever with the expansion of media. Um, the expansion of media noise and the areas of greyness and lack of clarity within our industry. And very often uh, the stories of these people are inextricably bound up with legal issues. And this is why legal journalism matters so much because, um, you know, legislation is difficult to follow and, uh, you know, it's not always known what the practicalities of what is decided in the courts will have on the people that have been most affected by crime in this country. And giving those families a voice, allowing them to speak directly to the public and show them what, you know, what effect it has on them is really important. And legislators and politicians pay attention to that and changes are made and that's what happens.